Hi everyone, we're back. This is Dave Vellante. I'm with Wikibon.org. I hope you enjoyed the live streaming keynotes from the Tableau uh, Customer co Conference. Uh, Kristen Chabot gave a, what I thought was a phenomenal keynote, one of the better keynotes I've seen uh, at events like this. And we go to a lot of events like this. You know, typically you get a lot of big, you know, strong vendor messages talking about their products and their new innovations and so forth. This CEO chose to talk about, in my view, why they launched Tab Tableau and why they started the company, what their philosophy is, what their mission is, and it was very, very powerful. And we're going to talk to Kristen Chabot tomorrow and I encourage you to tune into that. One of the more dynamic speakers that I've seen in a long, long time. But right now we're going to take a quick break with uh, in the action and we're going to talk to Burt Lattimore. Burt Lattimore's here, he's a writer for Silicon Angle, Wikibon, spends a lot of time with our user community, uh, writes the Peer Insight newsletters, and Burt has been roaming the floor at the Tableau User Conference, talking to customers, talking to uh, people at the event. So Bert, welcome to theCUBE. Thank you, Dave. So Pleasure what have you seen uh, at the show? What's, what's exciting you? Well, first of all, the, the uh, feeling of the show is so, people are excited. I mean, in the general session, people were cheering all the time. <laughs> uh, uh, Chris Schulte was- uh, They were cheering for uh, product features that were being announced yeah, and Yeah, cheering for product features. Yeah. I mean, Chris Schulte said, well, we've added we've added box plots, and people started cheering. You know, <laughs> I mean, this, these are people who are excited about this. Yeah, you right. know, and there's almost four thousand of them here, so there's a pretty good turnout for a for a, a you know for for a, what is really not a gigantic company. I mean, right? Yeah, two hundred million dollars in revenue and four thousand people. Pretty good user conference. Yeah, comparable in size and enthusiasm to the uh, ServiceNow conference. Oh yeah. So, uh, so what have you seen? Give us a quick rundown. We only well, have about two minutes. The exciting thing, the exciting things, of course, happened in the or, or exciting announcements happened in the general session that's just getting out. And the first thing was that what Schulte uh, promised an accelerated pace of development in general, with version 8.1 coming out in the fourth quarter, version 8.2 in early 2014, and then version 9.0, a major version in 2014. And then he introduced an, a series of people who talked about specific things that they're doing, and there's too many to go through here, but they are going, they are working for seamless data, access to data by, uh, in 8.1 and 8.2, basically get any data from any source into Tableau with simple visual operations. Uh, they've announced, uh, I think one of the really exciting ones is they've announced integration with R, full integration with R in version 8.1. Of course, R is used a lot for, doing advanced anal analytic, analytical predictive analysis. Statistics, yeah. And instead of having to have R open and Tableau open, you simply select the elements in your data plot that you want to put into R, select, uh, select uh, uh, external, external analysis, and it happens in an instant. They were doing it up there with uh, records of data flows from Rock Creek Park, which goes through Washington, D.C., and it happened Instantly, it was amazing. Hi, Bert, I'm sorry, I got to cut you off. Dan Jewett is here. Uh, he is the head of product management for Tableau. We got to, we got to go. Uh, but the other thing I'll add is they they announced uh, support for Macintosh, Tableau yes, for Mac. Yes, they announced sub, sub, Tableau so Bert, for Macintosh. Bert, thanks for coming on. We'll maybe have you on later and uh, and run it down. Keep it right there, everybody. We'll be right back with Dan Jewett right after this.